Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to study about types of leaves. Before that, we have studied about leaf. What are leaves and what are the parts of leaves? If you want to watch that video, you can go on the description box and click the link which is given in it and you can watch the video. So let's start our video, types of leaves. So what are leaves? Leaves are found at the node of the stem and are responsible for preparing food for the plant through photosynthesis. There are two main types of leaves. First is simple leaf and the second one is compound leaves. So let's see what is simple leaves. Simple leaves. Leaves of some plants have a single undivided leaf blade and a single midrib. Such leaves are called as simple leaves. So here you can see this is a science textbook. This is of 7th class Maharashtra State Board. Uh, they have given the definition of simple leaf and compound leaf. You can see in this chapter. Okay. I'll show you it. You can see this is Maharashtra State Board textbook of science class 7 chapter 2 page number 12 in this year you can see definition is given of two main types of leaves that is simple leaves and compound leaves i'll show you this one this is the simple leaf definition and below that that is compound leaf definition is given here compound leaf definition is given okay so, only they have given the definition. Okay. Maybe some of you may have difficulty in understanding what simple leaf and what is compound leaf. So, this video will help you a lot to understand easily. So, you will easily differentiate between simple leaf and compound leaf. Please watch the full video. Then only you will understand this concept nicely this is the definition of simple leaves leaves of some plant have a single undivided leaf blade and a single midrib such leaves are called as simple leaves next point simple leaves has only one leaf blade leaf blade or lamina that is connected to the stem or the branch of the plant next point is a leaf margin that do not touch the midrib. Now observe the image of simple leaf. This is the image of simple leaf. The definition of simple leaves is leaves of some plants have a single undivided leaf blade and a single midrib. Such leaves are called as simple leaves. So look at the picture here the center part of a leaf this one is called midrib the center part of leaf is called midrib okay and it has a undivided leaf blade so the lamina or a leaf blade it is undivided okay so Leaves of some plants have a single undivided leaf blade and a single midrib. Such leaves are called as simple leaves. Okay. So the example for simple leaves are mango, banana, hibiscus are examples of simple leaves. Let's see types of simple leaves. By looking into the leaf margins, we could also classify simple leaves. Leaf margin merely refers to the edges of leaves. Now look at the image of simple leaves. First one is entire, second one is dented and the third one is lobed. You can see its edges. Their shapes are different. The edges or margin is different, isn't it? So, the next point is, simple leaf has an axillary bud which is present at axil. 
look at the picture this is the simple leaf image that is petiole midrib axillary bud and branch you can see the image the axillary bud is present at axil in the simple leaf okay in simple leaf the axillary bud which is present at axil the next point is incision what do you mean by incision the incision means a cut okay so in simple leaf the incision is not so deep enough to reach the midrib now i have made two section of this board this is first part and this is second part okay in first part i will draw a simple leaf this is the image of simple leaf okay now we will name the part of simple leaf the center part is called mid rib mid rib or mid vein the leaf margin which i have highlighted it with yellow color is called leaf blade or lamina now my question is to you that do the edges of leaf touch the center that is mid rib answer is no the edges are not touched to the mid rib now look at the second part this is the image of leaf now i am going to highlight the leaf blade or lamina with the yellow color so this is the leaf blade or lamina okay so it is highlighted with the yellow color the part which i have highlighted with yellow color that do not touch to the mid rib you can clearly see this it is not touching to the mid rib okay so in simple leaf there is no incision or a cut in the lamina so there is no cut in lamina or no incision okay you can clearly see in this picture this was about a simple leaf you have to keep in mind that if in exam they might ask you what is simple leaf then write this definition of simple leaves leaves of some plants have a single undivided leaf blade and a single mid rib such leaves are called as simple leaves okay the second point of simple leaf is the simple leaf has only one leaf blade that is connected to the stem or the branch of the plant third point of simple leaves that is a leaf margin that do not touch the mid rib examples are mango banana hibiscus are the examples of simple leaves then the last point of simple leaf has an axillary bud which is present at axil and there is no incision or a cut in lamina so these are the points about simple leaves okay i hope you have understood you can write this point in your exam they may ask you some questions on the simple leaf now let's learn second main types of leaves that is compound leaves in previous part we discussed about simple leaves now let's study about compound leaves what is the definition of compound leaves let's see the leaf blade of leaves in some plants is divided into many small parts called leaflets such leaves are called compound leaves now look at the picture of compound leaves this is the picture of compound leaves okay second point leaflets connect to the stem node a short stalk or a rachis the third point is each leaflets does not have bud the bud are present for the whole leaf at axil this is simple leaf structure why it is called simple leaf because the leaf blade or lamina is not enough to reach the mid vein or mid rib now look here i am highlighting the leaf blade 
और लीफ मार्जिन विथ एलो कलर सी सो इन दिस स्ट्रक्चर द लीफ ब्लेड और लैमिना इज नॉट इनफ टू रीच द मिड वेन और मिड रिप बट इन कंपाउंड लीफ द लीफ ब्लेड इज डिवाइडेड इन टू मैनी स्मॉल पार्ट्स दैट पार्ट इज कॉल्ड लीफलेट्स एंड सच लीव आर कॉल्ड एज कंपाउंड लीफ दिस इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ कंपाउंड लीफ नाउ फ्रॉम इमेज दिस इज अ सिंपल लीफ इमेज ओके This is the simple leaf structure. Now I am going to highlight with yellow color its edges. That is leaf lamina or leaf blade. Okay, so it will look like this. Okay, now I want to divide the leaf blade into many small parts. So how I am going to do it? This leaf I have to divide it into many small parts. Okay, so look at here. this will become one part this will become second part this will become third this one fourth and this one fifth so how many parts i'm getting five parts okay from whole leaf so here the leaf blade is divided into many small parts okay so we will get like this structure so this part is called as leaflets it form as a small leaf like structure but we cannot call it as leaf because there is a incision means a cut in a lamina here you can see there is a incision or a cut in a lamina which directly touching to the mid rib okay it's directly touching to the mid rib this is the mid vein or mid rib okay so that's why the incision means a cut in a lamina and lamina is divided into many parts the middle part of a compound leaf is called rachis in simple leaf we call it as mid vein or mid rib okay but in compound leaf we call it as rachis and the small parts the leaf blade is divided into many small parts that part is called as leaflets this part we call it as leaflets in compound leaves the next point is leaflet connect to the stem node a short stalk or rachis and in simple leaves the leaf has only one leaf blade that is connected to the stem or the branch of the plant in compound leaves each leaflets does not have bud the bud are present for the whole leaf at axil and in simple leaf has an axillary bud which is present at axil so in compound leaves the mid vein or a mid rib is called rachis so this is the image of compound leaf the center part is called as rachis the small leaf like structure that we have already discussed it is called leaflets and the axillary bud is present at axil to a whole leaf so this was about simple leaf and compound leaf i hope you like the video please do subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching